from um, Speak You Want to come and um, just speak to us for a few minutes. Thank you. I'm not going to take the show tonight. The show is all about culture and what's been organized here. I really do want to say thank you to the organizers. This is really special. This doesn't just happen. I know there's a lot of efforts going into this. I know a lot of time going into this. And again, to the minister, I know that you people have a lot of requests to be a Jews. It's appreciated that you are here. It really is. Thank you so much. Really need those spaces. We need to interact with the world and say, 
these are the artists we have in the country, and this is their music, and this is their account. There is no better way to create such than to create sustainable partnership. Partnerships that already have a surviving and existing brand. So Stuki Motors came on board of our minister to say, when you get into a car, the first thing you look, you look at a particular dress, you look at a particular shirt, you look at a particular suit, and then you decide on the car that you use. So these are the things that have made the clothing industry one of the greatest industries in the world. Where we say, in order for you to get into a particular car, look closer to yourself. And because cars require a particular dress sense. And that is why we are here, honorable ministers, to say our fashion designers have made it be in international competitions. Whether it's an exhibition or it's a competition for beauty pageant, they always come back with a, a, a trophy. And that trophy, in most cases, is the local design, the traditional design. So we have uh, always made sure that our contestants and queens come back with that particular prize. That is why the Honorable Minister has designed a, a fashion magazine. In your labs, we have a fashion magazine. Uh, we also have our arts and culture, our culture magazine, where we, uh, we tell stories about our cultural ceremonies. We also have an arts magazine where we tell stories about our artists. We provide our artists. Some of the stories that are there on our minister, some of them I've never seen them. Uh, I've seen Polonja interacting with uh, Obama, and I've never known that until we, we saw it in the magazine that Polonja had an audience with Obama. And we realized that some of the stories that we are supposed to be telling is the world that the country doesn't know. It is my single honor, honorable minister, to just launch these magazines. Yours, honorable minister, is to launch the partnership, but ours in the office is to launch the magazines that we have in the country. The arts magazine, the fashion magazine, and the culture magazine. And we, we want to make sure that our artists and the people of this country know that at least once or twice a year, we will have a magazine that will be showing our artists' works in the, in the, in the, in the seasons. Uh, it is my honor, similar for that matter, that I launched the fashion shows. You can see them on the screen, some of them are there, but if you can't, uh, uh, get in now, you can always log in when you are home and you can get this magazine in there. But also, for those that are applying for events, Honorable Minister, we also do events at Arts and Culture. People can just go to online, online, they can apply or register their events and then they can apply. They send it through the office, then we will uh, either do the simplest thing, disapprove or another simple thing, approve, depending on our decision.
my honor and indeed a great pleasure to be here amongst you this evening on behalf of His Majesty's government for the launch of a partnership between the Swati National Council of Arts and Culture, our parastatal, and Stuki Motors. I should from the onset send our sincerest appreciation to Stuki Motors for the willingness to partner with us towards creating better lives for our young people, particularly those in the fashion industry. We are all well aware that the fashion industry is a phenomenon that is globally uh, and similarly all of us have, are here to attest to the great fashion talent that we have in Swatini. And yet the truth remains that we haven't yet fully exploited those talents and the opportunities presented by this industry in our kingdom. This partnership is an important step as we try to address that gap. The partnership is a platform created to reorient local designers to look inward for locally produced fabrics accessories and designs for their production lines. When they do this, they will be empowering the creative minds that weave the fabrics. The multiplying effect of that is that when we empower these designers, we will experience a lot of prosperity in our communities. Such a partnership <coughs> embraces the spirit envisioned by the post-COVID-19 economic recovery plan and strategic roadmap that was set up by government. A spirit of creating stronger and sustainable public-private partnerships towards creating a thriving SRD. I've already been informed that as part of this partnership, several fashion shows will be hosted each quarter of the year. And this will be a huge importance to the growth of the industry. When such platforms are availed on a regular basis, the ripple effects on the entire industry are massive. Most importantly, it is through such consistent, high-quality platforms that our fashion designers find improvement and smash through their own ceilings as they seek to better their craft time and time again. It is in this pursuit of growth and excellence that not only does individual work improve, but the collective work is elevated, therefore enhancing the industry's opportunities to attract and sustain investment. I therefore hope that all of us within the fashion industry will embrace the opportunities that will be availed by this new partnership between uh, the National Council of Arts and Culture and Stoki Motors. As a ministry, in pursuing this partnership through our uh, Arts and Culture Council, once again, underscoring our commitment, and indeed, His Majesty's government commitment to ensuring and pursuing all avenues for our young people to find decent and sustainable work through their talents. As I conclude, I wish to thank all of you for joining us here this evening for this important launch. I better take this moment to thank all those who have performed and showcased their beautiful talents here this evening. Once again, reminding us that Eswatini is indeed brimming with artistic talent. Lastly, I take this moment to once again thanks to Kimotos for partnering with us. It is my sincere hope that you will find this partnership also beneficial to your brand. It is now my pleasure to declare the Eswatini National Council of Arts and Culture and Stuki Motors partnership officially